It's time tomorrow we're getting ready for the wedding. I know. <laughs> oh, sorry. I didn't see anything. As you were. Don't you be getting hammered tonight. As if. I've got a four drink limit. I don't want to look like a mingle on my wedding day. I've seen your hungover face. It's still beautiful. Oh, you liar. Um, I think this is going to keep mm. happening. Well, there is a time and a place. We're not going to see each other now to the wedding. Oh, no, one whole day. Look after your mum, yeah? Make sure she has a good time tonight. I will. I'll see you tomorrow, Sarah Bear. <laughs> right, tell me you haven't got anything crazy planned. Uh, like a stripper? No, 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 don't worry. It's literally just karaoke at the ropes. OK. <laughs> oh, um, actually, there is something that I wanted to talk to you about. Please tell me you've changed your mind about the internship. No. In fact, I wondered if you could make my job here permanent. You're too good to work in a factory. Well, it's good enough for you. You've got the offer of a lifetime to do the job that you oh, love. Please, I'm not going through this again. I've made up my mind. Well, fine. Well, I'm not going to facilitate what I think is a stupid decision. Fine. I'll have to look for something else. In fact, I might see if Dev has got anything going at the kebab shop. Uh, 20 bucks. So, so the boost for tonight. Yep, on the spirits. Just go over to the flat first before you go to speed dance so you can get your costume on. What costume? Well, it's a superhero theme, so I've got you a full Spider-Man morph outfit. No funny business, you promised. No, I promise. You're not going to end up tied to a radiator or on a ferry to Boulogne. Don't forget, I've got to do the bids at number one first and stop the fight. Yeah, well, good luck with that. Speaking of a fight... I thought I'd put the bag on the pram. All oh, right, no, so it'll be, yeah, it'll be by the front door then. You've got keys, right? Oh no, nappies, they had, they'll be by the sink. I'm sorry, I've got a lot of things to think about at the minute, you know, stag doing that. All right, yeah, cheers. Bad dad alert. Stop talking rubbish, you're doing perfectly well on your own. Ha, huh, funny. Have you thought about doing stand up? Beth will calm down. It's not just her, it's everybody. They'll all have to. It's me and Bethany and serious about being together. Obviously, she's not going to London, that's massive. What do you mean? The job. What job? Uh, maybe I've got that one wrong. What job, Adam? Perhaps you should be having a conversation with Bethany. Hey. Hey. I thought I'd drop the rings with you before they do. Can you stick them somewhere safe, please? Uh, yeah, yeah, will do. Ah, London Flats. You persuaded Bethany to take the job? Yep. Good for you, mate. I must admit, I think you're doing the right thing. I know you miss her, but... No, I'm going with her. Are you sure you're not rushing into this? It's a perfect opportunity. For Bethany, yes. No, for all of... I thought that you might be the one person that was on my side. Look, I don't think it's a bad idea, necessarily. Just, can't you take a bit more time to think about it? There isn't any time. Bethany starts a placement next week, and frankly, I can't wait to get out of here. Sarah's not going to like this. Neither's Grandad. Well, do you know, it's London. It's not Timbuktu. There are these things called trains. Look, do us a favour, will you? Don't tell anyone about this before the wedding. A quite fancy one with that big, massive family fight. Don't you worry. We're not planning on telling anybody. We know exactly how everyone's going to react. React to what? Stag night stuff, Beth. Just Daniel's idea, superhero, silly stuff. Don't treat me like an idiot. That slapper's not moving in, is she? Because I don't want around Bertie every day. Well, tough, because she is going to be. But don't worry, you're not going to have to see it, because we're moving to London. <laughs> 